our iconic port city, Fremantle, could soon boast a new name. The local council wants to adopt the area's Indigenous name, but even the mayor had trouble pronouncing it correctly. It's a name footy fans chant with pride. But could the Purple Army soon be barracking for the Wallyalup Dockers? After being known as Fremantle for almost two centuries, the local council could adopt the Port City's Aboriginal name too. Fremantle will always be an iconic brand. I mean, the name Fremantle will always remain, but I think acknowledging that it had a name before that, Wallyup is not a bad thing. The proposal likened to that famous rock now called Uluru, but in Frio, locals are divided. It could work, yeah. I have nothing against it, it's their country after all. Keep it the same name, what, what's the point of changing the name to something else? Free Mandel, Frio. Free Mandel. it's Frio. <laughs> but state MPs aren't on board. Uh, acknowledging um, our history is good and making sure that uh, there's a historical acknowledgement of what things may once have been called, but Fremantle will always be Fremantle. They've got nothing better to do, obviously, at the council, and so they're just trying to make things up, when in reality they need to focus on the local community. If this proposal is approved in Fremantle, there are also talks about a dual name for the Swan River. It could also be known as Durbel Yerrigan, but that would require state government approval. Even the mayor admits it might take some practice. But how exactly do you, pr do you pronounce it. I'm Wally up. I've heard it's well you up. <laughs> yeah, I think there's a, 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 a subtle difference there. I reckon, yeah. I, I, I reckon you might be right. Cayman Gok, Nine News. And we want to know what you think. Head to the Nine News Facebook page where we're asking if the proposal for a new name for Fremantle is a good idea. So far, 80% of you say no, and only 20% of you say yes.